We gotta go grab our assignments. I think there's only 15 levels left. I think. And I think we started at like 37, so... Hey, Wally! Hey, Jesse! Been good! How was your vacation? Welcome back! You are back! Good to see you back! Don't act so happy to see me. Hey, Wally, could we get a shout out for Jesse? Let's see here. Your next mission requires this neon rank. This neon rank. Well, guess what? We needed 58. We got 15. Well, look at that. Your neon rank is sufficient to move on to a new assignment. You've earned yourself a heavenly delight ticket. How fun. How fun. A lot of fun. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. Of course. One moment while I Good check to on Mikey schedule. Thank you, Wally. Yeah, uh, Jesse's a friend of the stream. If there's anybody new here that isn't aware or know about Jesse, of course. Yeah, no problem. Wally helps out with that a lot. He's been very helpful. <laughs> um, mostly FPS streamer, but I think you're start. You're going to be branching out into some story-based games, right, Jesse? I was just typing it out. Gotcha. <laughs> Ah, there you are. Good to see you up on your feet. Ready to face Mikey's wrath? I took that hit all by myself, thank you very much. Filled him in while we were patching you up. I wonder how many days it's been. You were out like a light, you know. It was kind of scary. Wait. Did you guys see my junk? Why are we going to that? Why in the hell would we see that? It's nowhere near where you got stabbed. Just making sure. Jeez. Weird. We nurse you back to health, and all you can think about is your thing. I mean, most men, that's the first thing we're going to think about, right? Totally forgot to look for a new one on vacation, though. Sorry. <laughs> well, Sorry. you're on vacation. Really you, sh you shouldn't have to worry yourself you about all those kinds good. of things, you know? There's no worse than a paper cut. Good, because with the page gone, we've got to revise our strategy. Mikey had some not-so-great ideas he wanted to share. If you like stealth gameplay, Jesse, I highly recommend A Plague Tale. I don't know if you've heard of it or have played it before. It was very good. I enjoyed it. The story was really good, and the sequel comes out this year sometime. So. What if I told you that I've got a game changer up my sleeve? Oh. Then by all means, please steamroll Mikey in there. So. I think I talked to God. This is your game changer? <laughs> We're doomed. I know how it sounds, but while I was knocked out, I had this vision. Of the Lord. Yes, exactly. Well, that's what he said. Our little buddy's top priority. I didn't yeah. actually see <laughs> him. Yeah, sounds good, Jesse. If you've got, if you want any more recommendations, Feel free to ask, or if, I mean, it's your stream, so feel free to do what you want, but oh, yeah? we've got a huge really backlog God, of games that Wally's been me. Uh, creating for me to play through. <laughs> I, I can't. It, it was indescribable, but he took me to a busted up temple in the sky with a big old cross stuck in it. Hmm. Sounds like the third temple. Third temple? Where God used to reside before the believers took over and wrecked the place. It's been sealed up since to prevent trespassers. I would have remembered if we saw something like that on our missions. Maybe White's not crazy. Yeah, no crap. No crap. So you're telling me the big guy really spoke to you? I mean, it was mostly... But, I mean, it might be him. Did he ask about me? Uh, no. He just showed me that temple, then told me I could find the Book of Life there. But the third temple was so thoroughly looted during the war, there's no chance in hell the book wouldn't have been uncovered. I don't know what to tell you. I didn't believe any of it Maybe at first, you have to be worthy to get the book. I felt myself being pulled in the direction of the temple. Even now, when I close my eyes, I can see the path. 
Well, then it's settled. That's God's word. You gotta heed it. I wonder if I'll get the <laughs> okay. chance to talk to God, too. Maybe when this is all over, we can all sit down and have a drink with the guy. Ooh, that sounds fun. What's God's drink of choice, Mikey? Shirley Temple. Enough of this blasphemy! Get out of my <laughs> office and find that book before I smite you all myself! I was gonna say, probably God probably doesn't like alcohol. Maybe wine. Maybe wine. Alright. We got 15 levels to go, guys. Let's see how tough these get. These are probably gonna be a pain in the ass. Let's all just sit down and drink with God himself, right? <laughs> oh, only two levels here. A fuzzy navel. <laughs> Damn. We actually found it. The third temple. Didn't need no stupid page anyhow. Not with my holy guidance. <laughs> Why is there only two levels here? There's normally been ten each level. Bow before me, dumbass demons. I am your king. <laughs> God's touch really changed you, White. You're starting to sound just like the believers. You're just jealous. Maybe a little. No sign of Violet, huh? Doesn't mean she isn't here. We should be prepared to fight. You don't think she's already run off with the book? Nah. I'd imagine his grace would have his pointed grace. me elsewhere if that were the case. <laughs> I guess this is it, then. The culmination of our efforts. But we're level 15. We have to get to level 1. Daunting, isn't it? I'm being completely honest. I can't help but feel a bit envious of all the other Neons. Just out there, completing their missions. Seems a lot easier than this crap. It makes sense to feel that way. We've been blindly following orders our whole lives. Now, we're taking control of our own destiny. Yeah! Here we go. Uh Are there no enemies here? Odd. This is really weird. Oh God. Oh, this is really weird. This is like completely different than the, the previous gameplay. Nice, Tiny Tina's Wonderlands. Yeah, we played through that, Jesse. There's spoilers at the end of my last VOD for that game. But uh, it's a it's a choice piece of content. It's great. If you like to see people get upset. Uh... What the fuck? I'm just getting started. Oh shit! They actually give you a medal for this? God damn it, I gotta replay it. Fuck, I gotta go fast. I was standing around looking at shit. started it right before we left. This seems fine. 
<laughs> yeah, I... So, it was the first Borderlands game I've played. You probably knew that already. I, we probably talked about it right when, right before you left. Um, I had some issues with it, but I think it's mainly because of some things specific to that game. Not necessarily, like, a problem with the Borderlands series, in my opinion. But I'd be very curious to see how you take it compared to compared to me I think that'd be fun to see kind of annoying that I said that I was going to get gold on all of these. Because this one is not, I don't think, intended to be like, you get a rank for it, but maybe. Oh shit, I was reading chat, fuck! <laughs> yeah, I think... I think that's the exact problem that I had with it, uh, Jesse. Like... I came in as a completely new player, not knowing anything from the previous Borderlands games. And it kinda just throws you in and assumes that you've played the other games. Because, like, why would you play Wonderlands if you haven't played the other games, like me, right? Cause you're, cause I'm an idiot. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that was my main thing is like, give me more information about how these systems and how these mechanics work so that I can be more educated on what I need to do to be better at the game. Cause I had to drop, like, I only had like one or two weapons that actually worked well for me. Like that actually killed enemies cause the enemies were so bullet spongy. Um, And so I just kept those guns around and like I had to drop the difficulty to easy like the final boss was such a pain in the ass for me. Hopefully none of this is like spoiler stuff. I don't think I'm being specific enough for it to be a spoiler, but God damn it. That's fair. Yeah. I at least I I feel like it is. I I probably would have given it a better like reception if I had played the other games beforehand, I would think. If I go through all this again and don't get gold, I swear to god. Don't really mind spoilers anyways. Oh, okay. That's good to hear. <laughs> Sometimes, like, I don't think before I talk. I need to be better about that, especially with, like, that kind of stuff. Okay. Thank you. 
God fucking damn it, son of a bitch. <laughs> of course it's the one with no enemies that's giving me trouble. This is annoying. Sorry guys, I'll try and get through this. Focus, focus, focus. Someone play a game before I buy it so that I normally happens before I play anyways. Oh, I <laughs> gotcha. Well, this channel's perfect for you, then. Oh. All right. Don't stand around and gawk. Just get to the goal. There we go. That's got to be gold. It's because I'm the best. Yes. Woo! All right. I think we're going to get some story here. Surely. There will only be in two levels on this one. What is this place? It's horrible. Perfectly preserved massacre. You don't suppose these are all pieces of God, do you? Makes sense. That hand is enormous. Oh. I didn't even think about that. Do you hear that? Hear what? Show yourself! Right, look, the hand. It's opening. Something's floating down from inside it. Oh. The perfect hiding spot in plain sight. Grab the book and run. Holy crap. This is it. Yay! No way! Is it? We found the book of life. Ah. Uh. Horse. Run! Ah! Red! Hold on! I'm coming for you! Ah! They just stole the book, didn't they? Yay! I did it! I finally blew up that stupid red! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Violet? Ah! There you are, Mr. White. Thank goodness you came to bring me my book. That shot. That stupid hand wouldn't open for me no matter how many explosives I set off. We need a loot emote, don't we? Like blushing. Opens for those it deems <laughs> worthy. Green! Green! Violet, what have I told you about playing rough with White? There's talks about is how much he resents you after all you've done for him this music's really cool though he was never planning to share the book of life with you even though you're our leader but look now i've got the book while white is squirming beneath my feet like a worm here take it 
You don't need him anymore with me by your side. What do you say I punish him for you? Then we can rule over heaven. Just She's just us. got... Her eyes are just, like, empty. <laughs> oh, Violet. So young. I've, I know somebody IRL that can do that with their eyes, like, really, really well. Like, make them look like they're, like, dead. That's you very creepy. you yourself worthy, have you? My sweet, sweet... Even God himself denied you. <laughs> the twist! Oh what? my god! Why? You know better than either of us that the heart wants what it wants. And, well, I just have no intentions of losing my white. Wow. Violet! You still cry out for her. Even now? It's not her fault that you poisoned her. You taint everything you put your hands on. He said taint. <laughs> Perhaps you are right. You've always had such a soft heart, quite malleable. Malleable. Man, that's a good word. But that's precisely why I predicted God's hand would open for you all along. So he knew it was there. Hard to believe his clenched fist was all that shielded the book from the believers. And later from me. It's funny. I waited so many years for you to bring me this book. And despite all your kicking and screaming, I knew I could count on you in the end. Delusional. I didn't do crap for you. Oh, but you did. Try as you might, you can never untether yourself from me. Who do you think left you the page? What exactly is your plan here, Green? To take down the Believers. I wish not only to be freed from their control, but also from their hypocrisy and judgment. Red and I want the same. To restore heaven to what it once was. I don't think he wants that. No, no. You misunderstand. Restoration is just a changing of the guard. We'd be leaving our judgment in the hands of God instead. That's where it's supposed to be. What exactly do you seek from God, boy? Forgiveness? A meaningless concept. Union with his holiness? Unlikely. I didn't realize that this game was going to get, like, so into all know? of, like, the heaven and God and, like, all that kind of stuff. You think we will be rewarded after all we've done? We are both past the point of redemption. We were set up to fail in a world of suffering that he created. We made our choices. God had nothing to do with it. Can't you see, White? We never had a choice to begin with. God cursed us to a meaningless existence. Jesus. A meaningless afterlife. Yet, he sits We're getting into some heavy topics here. Our names in his book of forgiveness, as though that makes up for the pain we've endured. Has he ever once considered whether we forgive him? The believers could only kick God out of heaven with the book of death. But once I have both books at my disposal, I will annihilate it all. You think hating your own miserable existence gives you the right to destroy everyone else's? He's just gonna nuke else's? everything? You see it as an act of destruction. I see it as an act of mercy. Huh. And you're no better than the believers. I'm not letting you leave here with that book. Oh. And just how do you plan to stop me? I'm gonna get By the doing book first. I should have done a long time ago. Oh, boss fight. <laughs> <laughs> it's boss fight time. Well, I won't tell Red if you don't. You won't be able to say a damn thing with my sword down your throat. Here we go. Uh what the fuck? How do I get up there? What the fuck? What the fuck?
I gotta, I gotta destroy this over here. I missed this one. I think I have to restart. I don't... <laughs> it's a weird thing about this game. This is ridiculous. This is it. Ticking white. Brother. the fuck? What the hell, dude? This is insane. How am I... How are you supposed to do this? I took down that much of his health. Like a little smidgen.
Uh, the fact that you have to do all this in one, like, run, like, you can't make any mistakes, really. This is fun. This is no checkpoints or nothing. That would be ridiculous. Who puts checkpoints in a boss fight, you know? God fucking damn it. Give me that health. Whoa, whoa, whoa! This is fucking insane.
What the fuck? Dude. <laughs> Is this the final boss? I sure fucking hope so. This is ridiculous. I'm like figuring it out a little bit, I guess. I know, I've heard you say it like 10 times. Sorry, Brianna, I see I see your chat message. I just can't read it. Give me just a minute. What the fuck? But did you know that time is ticking? <laughs> but did you know that time is ticking? Ah, this boss fight is ridiculous. We're saving time. <laughs> for him to shoot and then do it I don't understand that that's bullshit because he just sends like a wave of shots at you
very important messages, yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Brilliant boss fight design. Have me use a fucking grappling hook that takes you... Just so you know, a grappling hook takes you from point A to point B, and in this game, in a straight line. So if the enemy is shooting shots at you, you have no way of, like, maneuvering to get around them. So... All right. Fucking fucking fuck shit fuck The fact that there's no checkpoints is what really irks me like you have to be you have to do this in a perfect line Is there like a strategy here that I'm like, does anybody else think that the, like I'm do, am I doing something wrong inherently? Cause I don't, I don't really know how to avoid those. Okay, I can't remember anything about the boss fight from here.
fucking crazy. What the fuck is this? What the fuck? What the hell? Where'd he go? Jesus fucking Christ! Why did it just reset me? Oh my god! Dude, what did I do wrong? No! So annoying. What the fuck? What am I missing there? This is it. Getting very good at this section. Is there anything else I can grab? Oh, that makes more sense. That makes way more sense. I didn't realize I can grapple onto anything that I want. I thought it was only the green things that I could grapple. So this, that, that makes way more sense.
health. down. Holy shit, guys. It's over, Green. God damn. He's still alive? Yes! Lay the final blow upon me! Yes. Yes. The halo is just I could see your soul ascend when you got that. <laughs> I am free at last. <laughs> Thanks, Jesse. <laughs> you see your light. It's just as I say. You are so hardwired to aid me that you will do so without me even needing to ask. Interesting. You put that goddamn halo in the path of my sword. I didn't do anything. Silly boy, don't be so humble. If I remember correctly, you were the one who chose to fight. Now the believers will be rendered helpless as I take their beloved book of death and begin my own day of judgment. No! Once you come to your senses, why, you're welcome to join me. We still got like 13 levels After to do. credit is yours. <laughs> After no! No! Get back here! I won't let you go! Bastard! She's still alive? You ungrateful bastard! How is she still alive? I won't lose pitiful fool you've already lost i have made my choice <gasps> yeah but you know what i realized we both chose wrong oh shit <laughs> oh the books destroyed oh, crap. What does that mean? Not bad Mission for a dead guy, 10 huh? complete. Mission complete. Hoo that there was a hard boss fight, fellers. Attention, Neons. We are in a state of emergency. Former champion Neon Green has been overcome by his sinful nature. He has stolen the Book of Death and has even gone so far as to murder my beloved comrade. The lives of many more believers are being <laughs> lost to Green as we speak. He is destroying the sanctity of heaven. Uh, nice to know Green is enjoying himself. It is one completely intact book. Any Neon who slays Green and recovers our book will be awarded to... Uh, <laughs> no, uh, Five years in heaven! <laughs> no, no, no. Five years in heaven! 
Can't you just detonate his mask? Not without the Book of Death, you absolute buffoon! So couldn't he just kill any one of us that he wanted? What about God? Why can't he help? Unholy scum, open your eyes! There is only us, the believers! What? What the hell are we even doing here then? <laughs> Screw this! The believers can't control us anymore! Where are you going? You must eliminate Green! Are you not enticed by heavenly delights any longer? No. Wait! Wait! Don't go! Don't leave us alone to die! <laughs> I wish I could be more smug about these assholes getting their just desserts, but... feels pointless now. Thousand pound butterfly. One day until judgment. <laughs> okay. Are we going to have a whole 13 levels left? Oh, the hell I think we do. Here. Oh, hello, Mr. White. Green stormed the place a short while ago. I was out getting coffee, but I imagine it was coffee. quite terrifying. I was out getting coffee. And you're still gonna stay here and work? Where else would I go? I'm the receptionist. In that case, is Mikey busy? Now, Mr. White, we both know the answer to that question has never once concerned you. Yeah, but it's my last day here. I figured I'd pretend. Go on ahead, Mr. White. Mr. Mikey is waiting for you. I filled Mikey in on everything I knew, but I didn't see what happened after the explosion. Violet didn't make it. She destroyed the book, too. Sorry. I was just at the sermon. I just needed a second to collect my thoughts. You think I ain't got concerns, kid? This is the second day in a row I had to patch up one of you jokers! Speaking of which, you holding up okay, Red? It'll be a bit before I can fight again, but hey, I'm not dead. <laughs> At this point, no explosion is big enough to do you in. They're not a reliable way Don't to say that. Me. Are you two even listening to me? Listen, Violet may have bought you some time from Green, but while he's distracted with the Book of Death, the pages of the Book of Life are still scattered out there, and the freaking Hour of Judgment is upon us. Oh, we gotta go collect pages so of a book? A oh, success, God. Haul your ass out the door and collect those pages. Stat. I said haul your punk ass out the door, White! What's the point? There's no way I can collect them in time. Especially if Red's staying behind. Don't be like that, White. Apparently Raz has some sort of tonic that will speed up my recovery. You can't carry us until then? No, actually, I can't. Have you not seen what happens when it's just me out there making decisions? We fuck it all up. I lost Yellow. I lost Violet. I somehow made Green stronger. Hey, pull yourself together. Of all the stinking If that was like the mid-tier boss fight, I don't want to know what the final boss fight's like. Get the wrong guy. Oh god. It's going to be like 10 minutes. I can my rage at Green all I want. But when all said and done, I'm just as much at fault for the death of our teammates, not just in life, but here too. What? I I'm just supposed to ignore that because God gave me a book that I instantly lost. Green was right. I mean, how can I ever even hope to be redeemed when I'll always be his puppet through and through? Are you done yet? Because frankly, I'm sick of your pity party. You know how many years I participated in the Days of Judgment before you came along? The first few times I woke up at the glass ocean, all I could think about was how painful it'd be to see you again. My heart was heavy with resentment toward you, and it only got heavier, year after year. But still, you never showed. This was the first year I saw you. My feelings were boiling over as I watched you float to the surface of the glass ocean. But then, all of a sudden, you stopped, and you started to sink. Without even thinking, I grabbed your hand. Oh, that's new information. And in that instant, I let everything go. I pulled you out of the water. And when I looked at your stupid face, I found it so silly. All that time I'd spent agonizing over the past. I... Hmm. 
I forgave you, White. So please, won't you forgive yourself? They're so into belts with this game, she's got a belt as a choker on her neck. Like a super thick belt, too. Got belts all over the fucking place. Surprised the cats don't have belts. This is a page from the Book of Life. What? A soul card? It's got to be insanely overpowered considering the source. But what can it do? God mode? Whoa, Mikey. How'd you get over there so fast? Kid, you just freaking teleported! No way. Really? <laughs> Holy crap! I bet that's not the only thing that card can do. <laughs> then, I guess I'd better go out there and test it out. <laughs> yes! There's the white we all know and love. We're gonna get all those pages in no time. We? Yes, we. I'm not about to let you hog all the action. Besides, I clearly ain't seen any neons today. We're gonna see a floating cat on a cloud out in the world. Fine. I guess he can tag along. Yes! Gabby, take over for me. I'm heading out. Is this a promotion, sir? It's whatever you want it to be, babe. <laughs> All right. 13 levels. Let's do this. There's 10. Must be nice getting out of the office to survey your old haunts, huh, Mikey? Yeah, sorta. They're all different now, though. What did heaven used to be like? <laughs> heaven. That's just what the believers made us call it. <laughs> the locals know it as Sheol. It wasn't much to write home about, but there used to be way more angels running around. I really miss them, you know? What happened to them? What do you mean, what happened to them? They died, moron. Iced by the believers. Oh, crap. I'm sorry. It's all right. Honestly, the worst part of all is seeing me on the damn masks. What's wrong with these masks? I actually always thought they were kind of cool. They're fashioned from the carcasses of dead angels, dingus. Uh, how what? was I supposed to know that? Only angels have the power of holy flame. When those masks are detonated, that flame is what disintegrates you. Oh. Seeing you all running around in those masks year after year. It's like being haunted by my mates. Man, Damn. that's crazy. That's gotta be rough. You wouldn't think it, but I was always the runt of my crew. I watched so many more capable angels bite the dust in the war. I didn't feel like I had any other options aside from swearing allegiance to the believers. I regret it, though. Dying with my mates would have been a lot better than living through this. But you know how it goes. Mistakes were made. No use dwelling on it. Right. Yeah. Hey, if I die with you here, it'll make up for my cowardice back then. You're not gonna die, Mikey. Not if you're worth your salt. Alright, let's do this. Boof. Boof of life. Or boop. Is that a P? Return this page to the Book of Life at the end of the level. Discard ability. Target a demon chest or barrel to teleport to its position, destroying it. This card can be destroyed an infinite number of times. Oh, shit. This is cool. What the fuck? Whoa. Approach the book. When it opens, use your discard ability on it to insert your page, completing the level. You do not have to kill every demon to complete the level. Okay, let's keep it going. Silver? How is that silver? 
0.05 seconds away. 0.05. God damn it. Didn't even break a sweat. That was only gold. Holy shit. You got to be like pixel perfect for ace on that. That's insane. You have to drop a whole second. Wow. What was I supposed to do there? What the fuck? down okay oh we're almost to the final 10 only got 33 minutes left in the stream Damn it. Break a sweat. Top ten. Whoops.
What the fuck? Oh, I gotta turn left. <laughs> Is that a mimic? God damn it! I hate that you can hit that edge. a mimic. Oh, I fucked up. God damn it. Yeah, Mondo, this game is crazy. <laughs> it's an FPS platformer card game dating sim. All wrapped into one. one way to put it okay i'll try and explain so as i go through the level i collect these cards right if i right click on the mouse there's a special ability associated with each card that makes your character do something it's also a weapon so like some of them are pistols some of them are rifles some of them are shotguns at this point in the game, we're basically just right-clicking through everything at this point. But, like, earlier in the game, you have to, like, shoot certain enemies to get certain cards to do certain things. And you have to, like, platform across to the end. And you have to do it within a certain time amount. And then you get ranked based on, based on that. Sorry, the music's really loud, so I'm, like, shouting into the microphone. <laughs> Shit. 
Fuck. Makes sense. <laughs> The uh, the VOD for the first part of the uh, of the game is up on my YouTube. If you're interested, I would take a look um, and see what like the early parts of the game is like. I thought this this has been like the gameplay has been excellent. The story and the dialogue and stuff like with the dating sim stuff I haven't done too much with. I just found a little bit of it cringy. But if you're here just for the gameplay. It's pretty good. No idea where I am. No! Okay. But it can it can get very triggering. <laughs> For sure. Cause like you have to do you basically have to do everything perfect to get through a level and get like either gold or ace. See, now I, I wasted my ability, and I can't, I can't smash this door. Oh, you lurked a bit during the talking scenes? Gotcha. story in a nutshell story in a nutshell so we are sinners brought to heaven to kill demons for the believers who killed god and took these two books <laughs> play the demo but uh just been watching demo and start, and then start it kind of falls off as you get into it yeah there's like a whole cast of characters that like had relationships in like before they died and stuff like that and then you find out more about like the relationships and stuff um but the main gist is like Whew. now we're really trying to like stop have the rest of we're trying to stop one of the other time. neons neon green from like destroying everything basically yeah. Damn it, kid. that's not dark Slow at all down. yeah right <laughs> But there's also, like, a decent amount of cringe in this story, I think, that's, like, throwing me off a little bit. I find it hard to believe God is paying attention to me at all. Well, too bad. It's the truth. You stink of divine intervention. Yeah, somebody else, I think, oh, who was it? Somebody else mentioned Power Rangers when we first started playing this, too. <laughs> I I, I, maybe it was Wally? -E? I can't remember. I'm just a dumb ape. God sees stuff the rest of us don't. He must have known a dumb ape like you would lead us to justice. Hell, your teammates lack any omnipotent sense, and even they still put their trust in you in their own way. The humor is good. Yeah, I like the humor. Knowledge, yellow with his guts, been violent with her dying breath. Doesn't that count for something? There's just some like. Trust is misguided. There's like some like anime style like lewdness that doesn't I don't know it just doesn't like play very well for me for some reason uh, this crap again. I'm not really sure why no because the characters like the this guy and the two other female characters like flirt back and forth a lot and I don't like it, it just didn't really land very well for me look I'm really trying my best to accept my heroic role but 
It's a tad difficult when I used to kill people for a living. Remember how I told you there's something about Yeah, I think you're right, Brianna. Yeah. Concept is great. Uh, but it's not as fleshed out as it could be. Yeah. I think that's because your soul is crying out to atone. What does that have to do with anything? Isn't everyone else here for forgiveness? No. They're here to escape hell. There's a reason why the Believers summon Neons with murderous pasts. Beyond the fact that their skills lend well to Demon Slay. See, the best Neons don't ask questions. They keep their heads down and their eyes on the prize. But souls haunted by the guilt of their past deeds aren't very good at this. Their guilt distracts them from medals and high scores. At some point or another, they catch on to the Believers' charade and start making trouble. Sometimes that sort of growth happens in the soul after countless years on the job. It's a lot of time to reflect, you know? That's what happened with Red, huh? Yep. But with her resentments towards you cleared up, I imagine this would have been her last year here. Why is that? There's a kind of filtration system at the Glass Ocean. The souls of those heavily weighed down by remorse aren't buoyant enough to reach the surface. Oh, that was basically us. Remember what Red said earlier? How you would have sunk back down at the glass ocean if she hadn't pulled you up? You think I wasn't supposed to be a Neon? I think that Red's act of forgiveness created a unique circumstance in which someone God could actually reach was finally invited into this domain. And you better believe that counts for something. Interesting. Whoa. Everything's upside down. Oh shit. Mess that up. Damn. This is crazy. Yeah, the upside down part of that is really throwing me off. We're like in Stranger Things now. It's very quirky. Shit. How did I hear about the game? I saw it. Where did I see it? I think it was the PC gaming show. As a part of Summer Games Fest, there was there was a show during Summer Games Fest that I saw the trailer for it. And I thought it looked oh, and I thought it looked interesting. Um, here. Oh, hopefully that doesn't crash the stream. Um. Oh, that's in all caps, but... <laughs> um, that's the website that I use. It aggregates, like, all of the trailers and all of the new games and stuff that are shown during E3 slash Summer Game Fest every year. And you just replace the year at the beginning of the uh, link, and it updates it. So they've got, like, a backlog of all the trailers and stuff shown. That's what I normally go to for, like, understanding, like, all the new releases and stuff. What am I supposed to do now? What? Ugh. Yeah, it's a really good website. I really like that website. Whoever manages it does a really good job every year.
Oh, yeah, no problem. No problem at all, Mondo. Uh, normally, so my schedule is Sunday through Thursdays at uh, 10 p.m. Eastern until 2, p- 2 a.m. Eastern. I'm in Central Time Zone, but I like to use Eastern just because more people live in Eastern Time Zone. <laughs> and, and most people are are used to converting from Eastern to uh, Pacific, if needed, or Mountain. How in the hell are you supposed to do that? Oh, I shoot it. I'm an idiot. I don't... Okay. I know what to do. Good to know. No problem. I need gold. Oh, man. I gotta do it again. Dang it. Oi, oi, oi. Come on, guys, we can do it. Seven levels left. I gotta do like a level per minute. <laughs> we can go a little bit longer tonight to finish off the game. All right.
What? How am I supposed to do this? supposed to do here? What am I missing here, chat? What the hell? See the... The problem is, you can't break the red wall unless you have a colored card. It has cracks? Yeah, all I can do is run into it. I can't do any- it won't let me do anything. I wonder... I don't... I don't understand. Now what? What do I do, game? Access. I'm just gonna look it up, because I, I think I've exhausted all of my thinking capacity here. Even know what level this is. So weird.
with access. I don't know. <laughs> Nothing's coming up. Here we go. I found a YouTube video. <laughs> Sorry, guys. All right, let's see how they do here. Access. All right, you use the red thing to get up. You grab that card. You go over. Wait, how the fuck do you switch cards? You can switch cards? What? You can switch cards. I didn't know that through this whole fucking game. How do you... How do you switch car? <laughs> How do you What? I don't think they ever told me that. Oh my god, and that's required to do this level. Holy shit. Oh, and I gotta switch back. Oh my god. Okay. go hell yeah what the fuck this level sucks Didn't even break a sweat. <sighs> yeah, getting that far without dying. Thank you. <laughs> the voice crack was great. I was so I was so surprised. I couldn't believe that. That's insane. All right, next. Oh, um, Wally, if you're still here, could we get a shout out for Mondo?
Oh, you got to go a while without the book here. Broke more than a sweat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh, what do I have to do here? They're switching things up on me. Ah. Shit, what is this? Oh my god, it feels like Star Tours at Disneyland. Yeah. <laughs> That's about right. Yeah, you're just bobbing and weaving all over the place. You don't even know where the hell you're at. You want to know where you are? Don't ask questions. That's where you are. You have to switch on that one again, too. These last few levels are taking forever. Ah! The fact that each one takes like a minute to get through is what's really a pain. <laughs> Buddy Five levels left was confusing as all hell. Instant death if you hit those. Okay.
Didn't even break a sweat. <laughs> that was close. I almost, I was like a split second away from dying there. Holy shit. All right. Three more? Four more. What the hell? Ah! They threw that at me all of a sudden. Should have shot that first. This level. What the fuck? Oh. Is this level? Holy crap! No! These are unnecessarily long now. And then I do that. God. Holy cow.
Yeah, you have to be like perfect on every single part. And every time you see something new, you have to like instantly split, like split second decision of what you're gonna do. Cause you only have like a half a second to figure out the, the next puzzle, you know? And it's also like a chain. Like it's based on the predication that like you did the right thing before and you have the cards that you need sometimes. things behind the broken doors and if you don't make the correct split second decision you're fucked yep exactly yeah that's they use the doors as like a, a way to like show you something new and like instantly think like you have to figure it out this is so long and then i forget what's at the beginning And like, I took the easy way out. Like, there's also the ace ranking that you can do for all these. And I'm like, no way, I'm not doing all those aces. this are you kidding me Oh, 
Ah, game. Yeah, I don't know what I was supposed to do there. I'm probably going to happen again. where I have to go. You have to look up. You don't look straight. You have to look up to get to the next part. Holy shit. Bear with me here, guys. We'll get it. Come on. One day we will see the end, yes. That is correct. clicked <laughs> whoa
Oh, got lucky there. Alright, here we go. Oh, it's right there. Oh, no, no, no! Contemplates all his life's choices that led to this moment. That is correct. That is absolutely correct. Why did I do this to myself? The gameplay looked fun, he said. Surely it's not rage inducing. Why would that be? Oh shit, Mondo, I never got you that, uh... We never got you that shout-out, did we? Sorry about that. I'll get that once I die again. Sorry about that. I completely forgot that Wally probably fell asleep. It's late for him right now. Oh, I don't think Mondo's still around. Aw, oh, man. I feel bad about that. Not if you die again, no, when you die again. <laughs> you know you're in purgatory. <laughs> Better late than never. Yeah, I just feel bad that he's not here anymore. I felt bad. Oh, this level. Fuck, dude. 
I think I've been on this level for like 20 minutes. brain fart there for a second. I couldn't remember what to do. Come on. long level. Brianna was here. <laughs> and we got the ace. Well, that's the last page. You did it, kid! And with plenty of time to spare! <sighs> I made it. Red! You're healed! Already? I told you you wouldn't have to hold down the fort for too long. Now I can help you guys gather the rest of those pages. No need. We're already done. Aw, see? You didn't need mommy after all. Cry after that, yeah. Shut up! <laughs> no one would blame you. You do deserve some credit. <laughs> I hope not. The page you gave me played a huge part in this getting done as quick as it did, so thanks. And, uh, sorry for being a mess. Honestly, I'm just glad you're finished moping. Then I guess all that's left is to get the book of death. Now hold on a sec. 
The reunion of the books is not all that's necessary to facilitate a proper judgment day. You'll also need the inkhorn. What? Inkhorn, huh? I think that plaque I read in the old city mentioned that thing. It's not just a thing. It's the pen God uses to write. Sorry for being a mess. That is a mood, right? <laughs> Last anyone saw, it was held in God's hand, which has since been sealed beneath the firmament. You can thank those damn believers for that. Wait, hold up. There are two hands of God? Well, duh. Of course there are, you numbskull. A right and a left. Forget the hand. Can you please explain this firmament to me? Ah, uh, you mortals are hopeless. Here. Let me show you. Think of heaven as a sort of snow globe in the middle of a vast underworld where God built his throne. Remember that wall you ran into in heaven's edge? That was the firmament. See, your souls are normally just hanging around here. But when the believers planned their assault on God, they pierced a hole in this firmament. During the days of judgment, you neons float into heaven through this exact hole. So then huh. you're saying the inkhorn is beneath this snow globe? Correct. And I have absolutely no clue how to get it out. We can't just go down there and grab it? You remember how the Book of Life was protected within God's clenched fist? Same goes for the inkhorn. Except God's remaining life force can't reach beyond the walls of the firmament. So that hand is stiff as a corpse. It won't open for nobody. That's exactly how the believers wanted it. They knew huh. that even if both books were united, without the inkhorn, God could not return. So then we need to figure out a way to bring God's hand into the firmament. How are we going to do that? We don't have much time. Whoa, calm down. It's going to be okay. You got a solution, kid? No, but I bet Green definitely does. Not bad for a dead guy, huh? Mission complete! We got one more mission. Three levels. All sermons are cancelled. For good. And yet, I can't stop myself from coming back to this damn place. Hello, Violet. I have no idea what's gonna happen next. But I do know it wouldn't be right to let this end without resolving all of our... unfinished business. This is my final opportunity to make things right. I better do a thorough job. Otherwise, what's the point? Hand of God, Judgment Day. Ooh, I got an update on a package coming tomorrow for the stream. I'm so excited. Oh, nice. I got a new piece of equipment for the stream coming tomorrow. Thanks for holding down the fort, Gabby. Yeah, I'm really excited. It was no trouble, Mr. White. Any sign of green? Last I heard, he was at the- he must be waiting for us. I'll save it as a surprise until I get it, like, fully set up and everything, and then I'll show everybody, like, what it does. You nervous? Not nervous, just... Wistful, maybe. I always thought that if there was an afterlife, you'd be the best version of yourself when you got there. Huh? Green. He wasn't always this deluded and nihilistic. It's easy to forget after all that's happened, but there was once a time when we were all... like a family. Yeah. I guess it just hit me that even if we succeed today, nothing's gonna bring those times back. Nope. We're long past that point. Even Green knows that much. In life, he was fueled by revenge. In death, by his regrets. How could he forgive himself? He That's harsh. never learn what it means to forgive anyone else. Hard on yourself. Mm. It's easier to just destroy. Forgiveness is the harder path for a reason. For all the time it takes, and all the pain it brings, it still won't undo any damage. It doesn't even make you into a better person. One might even say it's meaningless. Then why pursue it? So you can move forward, forge a new path of possibilities find peace. That's what this place used to be for, you know? A waiting room where you'd eventually realize that the only meaningless choice is one where you don't set your soul free. But I digress. This is it, Neons. Your final mission. Bring back God, or doom us all to oblivion. Thanks hey. for everything, Mikey. 
We won't <laughs> let you down. All right, here we go. Three missions left. Wait, two missions left. I'll take it. Can you <laughs> feel it, White? The window for Judgment Day is closing. I feel it all right. If this is another like 10 minute I long boss restored. fight. And I see you haven't done jack all. Where's the inkhorn? Or does that not play a role in your lame ass plans? Of course it does. How else would I write the entire universe into the Book of Death? Then what the hell are you doing just standing around here? You still don't understand, do you, boy? We can't accomplish anything here without each other. Can you quit being such a drama queen for once and tell us what you're getting at? As it stands, God's life force is trapped within the firmament. Fast forward to how you intend to bring God's hand back inside. <laughs> Why bring his hand in? when we can send his life force out. <laughs> we simply need to create an opening in the firmament that is larger than the pinhole that exists now. And how exactly do you plan to do that? <laughs> Dear boy, the solution rests right upon your face. The masks? Like, mask? You know what these masks are made of, don't you? Angels? Angels once used the power of holy flame to create portals which allowed them fast travel throughout Sheol. But as you've seen the believers demonstrate, holy flame in conjunction with the soul produces incredibly destructive results. Like what happened okay. when those neons were punished at the altar. Oh, I've acquired an impressive collection of masks from the neons I've hunted thus far. If all were to detonate at once, well, that would certainly do a number on the firmament, don't you think? Uh-oh. We'd still need a soul. And I just don't plan to give up mine. Is that a threat? An empty one. With the book protecting us, he couldn't detonate our masks even if he wanted to. You're right. I can't. And neither you mine. See, the choice must come willingly. So what are you saying? That this is a suicide mission? The white eye knew the life was always so obedient. He would have gladly volunteered for me. Too bad the white you knew is dead. Then, I suppose, we are at an impasse. He's gonna, like, kidnap her and use her to make me kill myself. Let the window close. You'll come to your or at least he's gonna try. I've waited this long. After all, what's another year? I don't buy it. There's gotta be something else we can do. If you believe there exists an alternative I've somehow missed after all my years trapped in this godforsaken place, then by all means, find it. Mm. Where did you put the other masks? Directly above God's banished hand, the Colosseum. Hmm. Then that's where we'll go. Wait, what? We just need a soul, right? We'll use mine. What? Uh oh. Very well. I'll meet you both there. Hmm. Red, no, you're not doing this. What choice do we have? We can think of something else. Just there is nothing else. Time is running out. Just let me think for a second. White, this is the only way. <sighs> no. If anyone is blowing themselves up today, it's gonna be me. White, stop. You're the one that got us to this point. You're the only reason I'm even here. You should get to finish it. It's only fair. What the hell does fairness have to do with anything? I... I don't know. I just... Please, don't make me do this without you. In all our years of training, only one person on our team could ever best green in combat. Do you remember which one of us that was? Uh, the fight against green is yours, White. This one is mine. Red, I won't let you do this! Just let me go. Let me do this. Whoa. Well, that was rude. Wait. Shit. 
<laughs> Just let me go. Let me do this. You can't stop me, White. There we go. Whoa! Holy shit. That was scary. Shit. Silver. We got to do it again. <laughs> I got to get gold. Fred, oh shit, it won't stop. let me. Please. Ah! You don't have to do this. No. I do. Just let me replay that me level. Give us a better ending this time. Red. No. Rip. <laughs> so, it is done. Red. Tell me, boy, did it feel good to pass on to her the responsibilities I'd given you? She was always so stubborn, never could train out of her. Oh, how she hated when you took her place. He's gonna go fucking crazy. She asked too many questions. You, however, would do anything I asked. So long as it meant you could fight. I could have sworn that fire within you still remained. But it seems I was mistaken. Yeah, White's gonna snap. The white I once knew is dead. Not that it matters. It will all be gone soon enough. Go to hell. What was that? I said, go to hell. Sick of hearing your crap. It ends here. One last battle to the goddamn finish. For yellow, for violet, and for red. Whoa. Looks like a spear. We have to race him to that? <laughs> yes! God's hand is ascending. The inkhorn will be mine! Laugh all you want, Green. You're not laying a single finger on that goddamn pen. Nothing can stop me. Time is ticking, White. What? Oh, whoa. This is some crazy shit.
fuck? Time is ticking. Yeah, I know, right? Oh, God fucking damn it. At least a few of these to set up, like, isn't bad. this one that's the real pain in the ass so far the fuck was that? Like, why do you present me with these puzzles that I have a split second to think about? What do I do here? Oh, I just go to that. Okay. Weird.
Dude, I think I had that one last one and that was it. That sucks. So close. That one is such a clusterfuck. One health left. Get fucked, bitch. Aced. Oh, we missed that one rank up. He's done for. Yeah, it was very close at the end there. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what's going on? I think God's coming back. God? Is that you? What the hell are you talking about? It's me, Mikey. That's what angels look like. <laughs> Doesn't look concerning at all, right? But you're not a cat. Yeah, no crap. I've been telling you guys that the whole time. Never mind, that ain't important. I just wanted to congratulate you. The acorn has reunited with the books. God is reforming. Where's this cigar at? <laughs> Crap. I'm asking the real questions here. He's got his sunglasses, but where, where's the cigar? You did it, shrimp! You hear that, Red? I freaking killed it! Now, I hate to split so soon, but me and the other angels gotta help facilitate God's return. Make sure every toe is accounted for. God is reforming is not a quote I thought I'd hear, right? <laughs> huh? Uh, Damn it. How is he not down yet? I don't know, but you can't let that brute get a hold of the ink form before God is reformed. Well, how long is that gonna take? I just had a freaking fight to the death. I'm running out of stamina. That pen is mine, White. The ink horn. I, I can use that, can't I? Hell, I don't see why not. Mr. Mikey, we could use some help here. 
coming! Wait, don't leave yet. I don't know how to do this. What? It's a pen, kid. You just write with it. I know that. I meant, which book do I write in? Do we get to choose? Mikey! The choice is yours, White. White! Damn it. I gotta think fast. Oh. So if we did all the, if we got all the extra shit, we could write it into the book of life, but we have to write it into the book of death because we didn't. Okay, well that makes the choice easy at least. <laughs> Give me that pen. It's already over, Green. What's happening to me? It didn't have to be like this, but you just never knew when to quit. It wasn't enough wallowing in your own hell. You had to drag us all down with you. We got the bad ending. But that ends here. <laughs> No one else should have to pay the price for the choices you made. Choice? Deny it all you want, but you've always had a choice. Every step of the way, and each and every time, you picked annihilation over taking responsibility. Well, I think it's high time you finally pay the price for all the destruction you've wrought. Uh, what have you done, boy? I gave you the ending you deserve. Oof. Uh, uh. Get fucked, man. Bye. So long, Green. Just a bit longer, guys. Come on, Raz. Quit slacking. Are we about to die? <laughs> yeah, he's out cold. Makes sense. Portals were never meant to use the inkhorn. Damn it, he really did it! The bastard saved heaven! I love how it's question marks. <laughs> you hear that, White? Rest easy. It's finally over. I have to look up the other option because now I'm curious. Yeah, it'd be interesting to find out what happens in the other one. Mission 12 complete. Aw, yeah. Damn, created by two people, game designed by two people, programmed by two people. That's insane. Wow. Very few people worked on this. I mean, for, for having such a small team, it was, I mean, the gameplay was fucking awesome. Some, um, definitely Tiffany Lockhart. I wonder if, uh, her nickname's Tifa. Um, there were definitely some moments that were, um, rage inducing but overall I mean I don't think you could ask really for better gameplay it was it was really 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 good fast paced action packed for sure I liked it quite a bit I don't think Pretty great game, all things considered. There are a few snags here and there, but with such a small crew as well. Yeah, yeah, I would agree. Yeah. And I think this is really good. And obviously, like, I didn't go through any of, like, the... All the memory stuff. Like, that, that probably would have been another... Oh, God. That probably would have been... Another good, probably, stream worth of content. Probably a whole another four hours worth. And we played this for like 13 hours. So it's almost 20 hours if you put like all of it in, I bet. Because there's extra levels and stuff that you can get if you get all the get. Because then you'd have to you'd have to replay all of the levels to to get to the gifts at each in each level too. go through all the dialogue for all of those gifts. And then there's also like extra levels associated with those, like every couple of gifts that you give them. So it's probably a shit ton more uh, 
game in here that we didn't see. But yeah, good stuff. Right at five hours. What? Oh. You're not going to write the kid into the Book of Life? Oh, is that because we didn't write Green's name into the Book of Life? Oh, boss. You expect too much from mortals. Sure, we didn't technically follow the Judgment Day criteria, but I don't know. I can't help but think he'd have decided differently if only he'd remembered the bigger picture better. Yeah, you're right. There's always the next life. <laughs> Level rush mode unlocked. Access it from the main menu. Uh, 